Okay. Uh, Berkshire Hathaway's uh, 2017 letter to shareholders just got released Saturday and I finished reading it today. So Berkshire Hathaway is a company that Warren Buffett runs and owns. And so usually I focus on what companies is. he bought in the year and what did well, what didn't do well, his general views on the economy and all that fun stuff. But 2017 was a special year because his bet with Protege Partners has just you know finished and Buffett won. So $2 million goes to the charity of his choice. And a little bit of context on what this is all about is that you have Buffett that says the average investor should invest in an S&P 500 fund. Basically, a mutual fund that is low cost and mirrors the market or the index of the market. For the US is the S&P 500, in Malaysia is the KLCI, I believe. So. Uh, Protege Partners is an investment firm. They get to choose five funds of funds. Funds of funds are funds that invest in other funds. In this case, are hedge funds. Hedge funds are like mutual funds, but they can borrow money and buy and sell. So that's leverage in that. The results are this. The fund that Buffett chose returned 126% over the 10-year period, while the rest of the funds that Protege Partner chose, the best returning one was only 88% and the worst one returned 2.8% to investors. You could get that from a fixed deposit. So why this difference? It's be mainly because of all the fees and transaction costs that the these companies charge to their investors. So that gives drag on their performance. Let's say the company makes 10% a year, but its management fee is 2%. So the actual return that investors get is around 8%. That's very simplistic, but I just want you to understand concept, of course. In reality, it's much more complicated than that, but let's just stick with that for now. So because of all these transaction costs and management fees, it drags down performance and it makes no sense to invest in a hedge fund or a mutual fund that charges a lot. Now, in Malaysia, if you buy a mutual fund from a bank, you usually uh, pay 5% of what you invest to the broker that sold you the fund and another 2% to, uh, for your annual management fee. So in the first year alone, you are down 7%. That's right, you lost money by investing in a mutual fund, 7%. And that's roughly, they could charge more, they could charge less, but that's around it from what i known and seen from Morningstar. So this is just some unique info to you guys about what's going on on Wall Street. And Wall Street is a good place to make money, just not very good for investors. So performance, I'm, I'm quoting Buffett right now. <laughs> performance comes, performance goes, but fees never falter. So watch what you're paying guys and invest wisely. Thank you, and leave questions, comments, anything. Have a great day.